Dr. Lakshmi Narasimham conducted a short workshop on space technology for the students of school, pre-university and college and explained them in detail about the Gaganyaan and Chandrayaan missions. On this occasion, the students said that they learned subjects like physics, satellites and rockets from the ISRO scientist Dr. Lakshmi Narasimham. So he was teaching us, like explaining us some he was explaining us some fundamentals of science which he knew and it was kind of fun because even the children who were there were very young were enjoying it and interacting with the sir even though it, it wasn't so boring and we had a lot of fun. Very excited that the sir came and explained us about rocket, what is satellite and uh, that uh, solar how how it will turn off to into the sun explain uh, sir explain us very nice i thanks to him. he explained us whatever is going on with him in the science uh, industry he exp explained his experiences with us he shared so many fundamental uh, you know laws of uh, so many scientists we have learned many things about the satellite he was uh, an inspiring person uh, we learned how the rocket works and how we can restore it and how we can uh, reuse it and it was very interesting. I learned about some physics, um, so I was studying about the planets and the satellites. A new invention when the people are uh, about, when the rocket is gonna fail. Rocket about turn and distance and about vacuum, how rocket will go in space and it will about means how people will say. Sir shared what he did in entire his career, like how he experienced with his friends. He's a famous scientist and uh, he's experienced scientist and he said about uh, his missions and all. So we get sick knowledge man, by, by his information and uh, we enjoyed his uh, speaks and what he said. On this occasion, Dr. Lakshmi Narasimha, a retired scientist of ISRO, guided the students and said how children should make space technology their dream and strive to make their career in it and achieve significant success so that they can make India's name shine. Actually, science is the simplest and very, 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 very easiest subject to understand because that in our day-to-day -day, our life, we are coming across the science space. In all our space centers, have, our doors are open for students. Okay. And uh, we have a weekly or uh, no, the once in a month thing. Okay, all all school children uh, they can come and visit our ISRO facilities. And another thing is uh, during engineering course or politics thing or science this one, they have actually internships also there. And actually that uh, implant trainings also there. And actually they can enter as a project trainees also during their uh, uh, academic. Director of Falcon Institutions. Dr. Abdus Subhan said that the students should not be afraid of failure during the journey of achieving their goals and realizing their dreams, but should learn from them, succeed and grow. Most importantly, I think uh, the, the very basic uh, objective of his visit was how do we give a dream which most of the students uh, in the uh, entire uh, when we look at Falcon, anybody, everybody who joins Falcon, that the dream is always to become doctor or an engineer. We wanted to reshape, re redefine their goals. How do we bring out a new narrative altogether, especially for the children? Because they have seen the heroes when it comes to the real life heroes for them is been doctor always, especially when it comes to COVID and all that they have seen that. But the message which we wanted to give for the 21st century and the forward and the future belongs to those who create new things and these are the scientists and when we had this senior scientist from ISRO and when he gave the a very practical experience about rocket and then uh, satellite and he gave few very great insights to the children we wanted the children to start dreaming that that is also possible and that particular person who used to um, uh, the scientist who had come he shared his own background that he used to walk barefoot three kilometers to go to that sarkari that government school if that kind of person can make it to isro 
and achieve whatever he has achieved. He has uh, been part of so many space programs. He was sharing that experiences and the children were, were mesmerized. So our whole idea is how do we bring that inquisitive mind in the children and that is the whole purpose and we were so thrilled and the children were so happy to have him on the campus and then they learnt a lot. I think they, they are going to relish that moment forever.